this is Nell Foster with Joyous Garden and today I'm going to show you how to paint and decorate terracotta pots. Welcome to my garage. As you can see there is not a car that goes in here but I do all my crafting and I also do my potting on here too. These are some pots that I have done to show you and I'm going to talk about them a bit more in detail at the end but what I use um, is leftover paints. I, I'm very into re reuse and recycle. So these are my leftover house paints. And you want to use exterior paints if you're painting exterior. You can use interior paints if the pots are going indoors. I also do, um, I also add some metallic glazes in too. And these are the metallic master's paints, which I love. I had a Christmas decorating business in San Francisco for 15 years and I'm really into glitter and, and, and metallics, but this adds a nice, um, this adds that nice, gold and this is the bronze here and th this is the metallic green on there it just has a little bit of a nice sheen to it so what I did with this pot is I just freehand I, I drew some circles and sit same up here this is an enamel paint I used on my bistro table and then I did this to do the dots I just put a felt disc glued it on top of a pill bottle so you can just stamp the dots on there and then that this is an old bracelet taken apart. I put a, a little bit of glitter on it and then glued it with this contact cement here. Same with these. This is one I did a while ago. It's all metallic masters held up really great. This is very free form, very flowing. I put some brown colored discs on that. And this is one that I'm going to put some flowers in. So I, I left it pretty plain. I just did the, um, this is the trim on my house same color so it'll go with the house and I just did these little bursts here with a little bit of blue on them because I'm gonna have color in here and this one I use that enamel paint and what I did is I just took this whisk and I, I did the bronze on here and then I sponged um, where's my sponge oh here it is and, and then I sponged some of the metallic gold on there and I thought that this is concrete stain. I thought it was going to just make it antique -y, but what it did is it gave it a yellow sheen to it, which I actually really like. It turned out it was kind of a mistake I'm very happy with. And this is Christmas garland. It's Christmas bead garland. Just glued around here, and the discs are put on here. But you can use anything for embellishments. You can use buttons. You can use, you, you can easily find these shell necklaces you could use that there you, you could drape it on there I have more of these discs I use a lot of these and the other thing you can do if you want to is you can seal the inside of the pot because terracotta is very porous so I didn't seal the inside of this one it's been fine I did seal this one because I'm giving it as a gift this is Nell Foster with Joyous Garden for eHow.com and I've just shown you how to paint and decorate a terracotta pot Thank you.